After the introduction of the X certificate, there were a lot of high-end, high-quality films from Europe, and uh, Emmanuel in 1974 was just the latest. You'll have to tell us all your adventures. <laughs> tell us. You can tell us everything. In the 70s, there was a growing curiosity and desire in the movie-going audience for a little more explicit nudity and sexuality. It was a very changing time. Everybody was very scared about eroticism at that time. A more romantic vision of sex, more like erotica than pornography. You're not ashamed, are you? Oh, of course I'm not, but I'm a little surprised. It was the sort of cultural phenomenon that meant that people went and saw this film who wouldn't have seen any other film with Emmanuel in the, in the title or any other film of its genre. The Emmanuel in Space cult following grew and grew to an exponential number that I didn't even realize really was even going to happen. Sensual and sexual without being graphic.